It's predicting an avalanche of red ink, and its ridership isn't yet two-thirds of what it was pre-COVID, but that is not stopping the MTA from planning big time for the future. Yeah, today in Brooklyn, the MTA rolled out its new subway car wow. of the future. It is streamlined, safer, accessible, and there are security cameras on board. And the new cars will be ready by fall. Here's Iowa News reporter N.J. Burkett. We wouldn't have the press on if we weren't satisfied so far so good. It's the first passenger run of the R211, and the passengers are reporters. MTA officials proudly showing off what they're calling the subway car of the future. A gleaming silver rail car that glides along the tracks and seemed unimaginable just 20 years ago. What's known as an open gangway train. The first thing you notice about the new subway cars is there are no interior doors, so you can walk easily easily between cars. The new cars feel open and airy because there's more interior space. In fact, 10% more interior space. And MTA officials say the new cars will be far more reliable. These cars so far as they've been tested in our system are really much more reliable than cars that we have operating virtually anywhere. And because the exit doors are wider, passengers can get in and out faster, which means less time at station stops. Literally dozens of surveillance cameras are spaced throughout, monitored in real time by train operators and conductors. We've talked about cameras on our subway uh, network and our subway system. All of these cars will come with cameras uh, to ensure safety of our customers. The R211 is intended to replace the dreaded R46s, dingy, decrepit cattle cars that carried three generations of New Yorkers and still do. They're the oldest subway cars in New York and first went into service in 1975, still running on the A and C lines and the Staten Island Railway. One of the challenges we have is keeping these old cars in service, and so this will help deliver better service for our customers. The first of nearly 1,200 R211s will be in regular service later this year, including 20 open gangway trains. Not exactly the Orient Express, but it's not the R46 either. In Coney Island, NJ Burke at Channel 7, Eyewitness News. We will take it no matter you what. You betcha. Exactly.